Okay, here it is by popular demand. That's uh, a Sterling engine fan. And the idea was you blow air over the the um, heat sink. Let me turn this down a little bit in here. And uh, anyway, I just took that CD off and I had a plastic fan. They use these on wood burning stoves. You can buy these Sterling engines that have a fan on them. Anyway, this is just a test model. It's not practical for anything, but it's an example of how you can uh, put a fan blade uh, instead of the flywheel. Take it off here and let it I'll let it run down. Yeah, I just happened to have a fan blade uh, that fit on that close enough, so I put that on there. But uh, that's pretty neat. Just thought I would uh, try that out and see. By the way, the displacer, that foam uh, sponge displacer, is all melted inside there. But the thing still works. I was real surprised. But anyway, that's a fan uh, Sterling engine, a Sterling engine fan. Which uh, I don't know if I can get it to go again here. Not. Let me turn this flame on. Turn it way down. Sometimes I can get a second run out of this. Sometimes not. Uh, what I did was I put this in the freezer and got it really cold before I did this video. Let's see if it'll run again here. Sometimes I get a second run, sometimes not. Remember, this is just a uh, a model. It's a proof of concept model, and it's not meant for anything but like a science fair project or just something that you can uh, demonstrate the model of uh, a Sterling uh, cycle, Sterling engine. But yeah, I, that's uh, rather interesting. The uh, fan blade doesn't have any counterbalance weight on it or anything it's just uh, just right there I think it's pretty cool thanks for watching